Good morning, YouTube. It's Mommy Ray Ray, and I'm about to show you how we do it this morning. How is everybody? I am going to have a mug bang with my Bob Evans sausage this morning, my grits, my eggs, and my tea, guys, my black tea. I have my water boiling for my grits, and guys, I'm about to go in. I know you guys know about Bob Evans. They're the great sausages. I love them, guys. I don't just have to have them for breakfast. I buy the patties as well as the links, guys, and I eat them up. Got my oven preheating for my toast. Most people like to put them in the toast oven like my son, but I'm going to make mine a little special. Got my cast iron skillet, guys. I keep it oil, guys. That's how I store it. I keep it oil. But I'm going to go in, guys, and put my sausages in. And I'm going to let them cook. I got about three people I'm feeding this morning and maybe one on the way. So I'm going to go ahead and put these all in, guys. Because they won't go to a waste at my house. So these are Bob Evans sausages I'm cooking, guys. And I'm going in. So as I go in, guys, I'll bring you back in here. I'm going to get this going and come back to you guys. I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. As you can see, my sausage have browned, and I like to put those on first, guys. I'm going in with my butter. I don't want them in my toaster oven. I want this in the oven, guys. I love a toaster in the oven. I'm going to put those in, guys. I'm going to put those in my oven. Let those bake. I'm going to go in, guys, with my sauce inside of my grits. Put a little sea salt in here, guys. Because that's where you're going to get your little salt from. You don't need much. And I'm going to go in with my grits. So you got to remember to keep these really creamy. You're going to have to keep stirring them, guys, so that they will be great in taste. So we're making grits this morning. Sausage going, grits going. I'm just going to keep attending to them. I am going to add some milk, organic milk to them once they cook down a little bit with some butter. But right now they're going in. You can in there and let them, let them see that. I want to take my sausages out, guys. And we're going to have breakfast this morning. You see that? All right, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm going in with my eggs. I'm going to put six eggs in here. Like I told you, I'm feeding a couple of people this morning, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them in over here like that. That's two. Three. They're so big. I didn't, oops, I didn't know they were that big. Four. Put one more in here, which makes five. I'm gonna go in and put them in like that, guys. Okay, you want to get your salt and pepper ready at this point. Put your salt in just a little, a little pepper. Okay, and I'm gonna get my whisk and I'm gonna whisk them up. See that? They're going to be perfect scrambled eggs. Okay. You guys see that? I'm going in for a little milk, guys, just to stretch them a little bit. Got a little organic milk here. All righty. So, you'd be surprised who can't make an egg. I'm just going to add a little more pepper to this. A little more pepper. Whatever you desire in here. I even hear that people put onions and make it like that. You could put your green peppers, whatever. But I love pepper on my um, eggs, guys. Okay, guys, I'm going to put this to the side and go in and check on those grits. 
see what we got going here. See how they're forming together? Got those grits coming in there, looking beautiful. Just gonna turn it down a little bit. See that guys, look how creamy that is. Okay, now I'm gonna also do this guys. I'm gonna go in just with a little milk, just for the creaminess. Then I got some butter. I'm gonna throw in there. And I'm gonna whisk all of this in. See that? See, if they want more butter, they can add it they sell. That's how I make them, guys. Beautiful, creamy grits. I know somebody is saying, what is Miss Ray cooking with which grits, guys? These are your Quaker Quick Minute Grits. This is all I know because this is what we were raised on. My grandma always bought the Quaker Grits. So that's what I always have. And I put it in there. But I think I'm going to go in with a little more butter. Like another teaspoon of butter. That's what I'm getting to put in there. We just keep it at that. All right, guys. I'm going in with some Kraft cheese slices on my grits. And I guess someone may be saying, why is she making grits on TV? There's a lot of people who cannot make grits, guys. So... I went in with my cheese he grits. This is what we're gonna have. They love my cheesy grits. And I'm just gonna work it in. And after I give them their plate, I'll put them another piece in their grits, guys. But if you want cheesy grits, do you see that? That's your grits right there. So I'm gonna put all of this together, my grits, my eggs, I'm sure you guys know how to scramble your eggs. I'm going to put all of this together, and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like, and we will be back. All right, guys, we're back, and I'm about to dig in, guys. I know you see the steam from my grits over here. We're hand me a bowl. Yeah, guys, I'm ready to rock and roll. What did you say, Ray? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So these are my grits, guys. I'll let Rayla show them to you. See. Wonderful breakfast. We got pineapples, sausage, and scrambled eggs and toast. And there grits. You go. Cheese grits. Let's bring them in. All right, now. Nice and thick and fluffy. All right, guys. How you like your grits? You want your own toast now? Yeah, I'm going to put some jelly on there. So here's my grits, guys. Can you see them? They're hot. We got, uh, what is this? Oh, grape jelly? Is that jelly or jam? Jelly. See? All right. So, guys, I'm going to go in. I'm going to pray, and we're going to eat. Father, in the name of Jesus, I just thank you for this breakfast this morning, Father God. I just thank you for my hands that prepared it, Lord. Today, I ask you for a special prayer, Lord. Let this food digest well in our bodies. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. All right, guys. So, we're going to dig in. I know Raylan's kind of showed you all the sausage, my barbecue sausage, my eggs, my pineapples and toast, and grits this morning. So what's going on in your neck of the woods, guys? It's raining in Michigan this morning. Raining. Raining. So we're trying to really keep ourselves happy this morning, guys. Unfortunately, a thing happened to us. Yeah, you can put it on there. I love fresh pineapples. Is this a distraction? I'm going to take this and move it over there. How about that? I'm going to take and get me. I'm going to take three sausages, guys. And I'm going to put me some eggs on here. Uh, 
Yeah, that's more than enough. Alrighty. My pepper eggs, y'all. I love pepper on my eggs. So, yeah, guys, we uh, I love my pineapples. Yeah. Just put a few on my plate, and then we're gonna take this and put it out, get it out of the way. And that's what I got, guys. This and my grits are right here. So, what are you guys doing today? What's everybody doing? So, guys, yeah, I, I want to share some things with you guys today. It's Thursday. No, today is Wednesday. Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning. So unfortunately, guys, we woke up in the D to my son's car stolen. Yep, somebody took my car today. It's gone. Wow. Gone, mm. gone, gone. Is this going on in you guys' neck of the woods? Is, is cars mo moving out like just totally? We got some H2O this morning, guys. Some water. I didn't even make my black tea. That's another story there. I'm going to save my black tea for later and come back to you guys and talk to you with my black tea. I'm going to drink water this morning. I'm trying to just encourage myself as well as my son. He works so hard guys to get where he's at. He doesn't bother anything or anybody. So you know, they took his car. He's paying over like full coverage here in Michigan. A young guy you're looking at $400 a month. No fault running people $280 a month, guy. So I don't know what's going on, but it's like we're in the I don't care city right now. Nobody cares. We need paper towel. Paper towel. Yeah. So, you know, when you're, the, I don't want to say that on my YouTube channel. Some things I'm going to have to kind of bite my tongue with this morning. But it's, nobody's not caring. And that's one of the reasons why it's time to leave Michigan. Nobody cares about nobody. And that's sad. It is very sad because it's like when you get put in positions like this, it's just like, what do you do? Do you get upset? Do you get mad about it? And it's just like, well, you can't really do much about it anyway. You just got to just... Hope for the best, you know. And that's what I told him, guys. That's when you just pray. When you just ask God to take the will. Because there's so much happening in Detroit, I'm sure. I just would like to know, is this happening in your state? Where you live at? Is there cars being taken? This is like our second one. Mine was taken, and now his. I had a Ford Focus 2015. So, my thing is, what's really going on? What is going on in you guys' neck of the woods? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Raylan, we have it on video, guys. Raylan actually wants to show you guys. Yeah, I'll insert the um, a clip in. I know it's well. I just put it in the um, in a clip. It should be. I'll show it probably around this time, so that way you guys can see it. All I know is, is that um, they just they just took it. So just waiting on the police to find the car, at least, so I can at least know where it's at. Hopefully, they find it. And if they'll call you on time, or will they leave it in the pound for eighty days and then tell you it's there? That's what we got going on in our city. I would hope that everybody would subscribe this morning. And give me a thumbs up for this video and a comment if you're hearing me. My voice is for a reason. And maybe move it to your state soon, guys, because I'm not going to stay here when we can't even get people to do anything. It's so unfair what's going on in Michigan. It's so unfair. Taking of the homes, people. Stealing people houses and stealing people cars is what we got going on right now. So, you know, just figured I'll show it, share it with you YouTubers because you guys are showing me so much love. 
And I appreciate each and every one of you who come and look at my videos and subscribe to it. I just really appreciate you guys. You just don't know. It's like my grandma used to say, and my grandma Ruby is very special to me. And my mama too is special to me. But my grandma used to say, oh, Lord, when it rains, it pours. And I just used to hate to hear her say that. But I feel like it's pouring, guys, on me with all we got going on. You know, police pulling my son over. He's clean, squeaky clean. They can't do nothing. So they want to give him a ticket and tell him to pay it. If he won't get any points on his record. So if you kind of like get a ticket in the suburbs... That's like going over your city limits. Like if you're in Detroit and you go to Royal Oak, Ferndale, Sterling Heights, they're pulling the guys over and they're giving them tickets. And then they tell them to pay it and it won't be any points. And the thing of it is, it's the same district giving all the people the tickets, the black guys. And it's not about a racial thing. It's just sometimes they just don't want you in their cities. We got the stealing of cars, the stealing of homes, and it's really sad. But I cannot stress this more. Please comment and tell me if this is going on in your city. I want to know. What is your law enforcement right of about in your city? What are they doing? Do they work with you guys? Or they... Just leave it. I really want to know. What do you have to say, Ray? I don't, I don't know, really. It's really hurt, guys. And he not really. Well, but it's like, I'm just dealing with it. It's just like, it is what it is. I mean, it's not much that I can do. Because it's gone, so. Yep. Mm. Yeah. Basically. So, we'll find out. Oh, man. These Bob Evans guys got to try them. They are good. They're really good. I like the links as well as the patties. So, yeah, I'm just enjoying that was, um, my Pearl Man. He opens the pearls up and it makes my day, darling. Mm -hmm. You guys should watch his station. Good guy. And shout out to him. I want me and my mom will watch your videos. And thanks um, for um, supporting my mom and commenting on her stuff and everything. Darling, I love you. Shout out, I love you. Eat my pineapples, guys. I love them. See, I'm going to show you guys how to cut this when you get a pineapple and make like a pineapple drink from it. I'm gonna have to do that on video real soon. Mm -hmm. My son and I love pineapples. Isn't that something? He loves them and I love them. I can't buy a can, I can't buy a whole one. We both go for it. So I try to keep pineapples in the house all the time. And they're good for you guys. They're really good for you. The one we got today is real, real fresh. It's like it's sugar. Mm-hmm. So we had our grits. Mm. I mean, these grits are delicious. On a day like today, it's a good day for them. It's really kind of gloomy. It is. They're still hot. You want more grits? Mm. Yeah, just a little. Thank you. You're welcome. So, yeah, guys, we want to just, just kind of get that off our chest this morning. So, I hope you're enjoying eating with us and our little talking that we're doing. I guess I hope our spirits are connecting and that you guys are enjoying the video. Mmm. These grits are delicious. Mm. Oh, I know it's chocolate. Oh, no. Um, 
Yeah, this is correct. So, I think what I'll do is I'll show you that. You guys, tomorrow I'll make a video. I think I'm just going to relax today. And try and not think about all this that's going on. But please, guys, I would love to hear you guys comment <clears throat> on what's going on over here. So, guys, we weren't going to keep you long. I just wanted to share that with you. If you could, guys, could you please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that button, guys, and a comment. I did end up in emergency with strep throat yesterday, so I'm still choking but believe it or not whatever he did to me it, it went down a lot my neck was very swollen <coughs> oh, excuse me so I have had my medicine dose this morning but I'm going to relax like I said so guys if I can say anything I say when you go in go, go in hard. hard so guys we're going to end this video and you guys have a great day Subscribe, hit that bell, give me a comment and a thumbs up. I'll see you soon. The best is yet to come. come. Bye.